Well, as uh, with everything, uh, all ways are God's ways. Um, I was given instruct instruction this morning that I was put through the fire to be a light unto the world and I am not to retreat. So this page will have a, a total overhaul. I've already changed the name. It's uh, now being called Enter Nirvana. All association videos, anything ever said on this page under the previous name will be removed um, re as related to the demons. The ones who are out here as false prophets who have tried to prevent me from completing this path. Their names will never be mentioned on this page ever again, and anything ever related to them will be removed. Um, this is my instruction. Who is this page geared for? It's geared for all who are lost who are wandering around in the dark, who are searching for the Lord, for the source, for God, for Jehovah. Um, you are all welcome here. People suffering with addictions of any type, sex, drugs, alcohol, any type of addiction, you are welcome here. This is an open call from the source. The time, the time for anyone to reach out to me and speak to me is over. The comments have been shut off. This, this will not be an interactive page at all. This will be a page strictly to guide you to the light. This will not be any type of social page for me. And I will, I will also post from teachers who I feel are emanating from the heart and who will help you. I will post from those people on this page as well. And for those who are serious, the Lord is extending his hand to you right now. And the, so the first thing I'm gonna do on this page is I'm going to read from the Holy Bible, the book of Romans, chapter 1, verses 18 through 30, and how unbelievable this is everything that has been encountered on the previous page with all of the false prophets. And I want you all to listen to this, internalize it. Always, always, always keep going inside, inside, inside. There is only one guru, and that is the source of all creation. Every, everyone else was sent by him, from him, through him. Jesus Christ himself was called rabbi, teacher, not guru. The very first commandment that was given to Moses was, I am the Lord your God, you shall have no false gods before me. And then I was given this chapter from the Bible to read this to you this morning, which this says it all. This says it all. So, Father God, I ask that you bless this reading, that you bless all the hearts that hear it, and that it leads them straight to you. I ask that you bless this page, let only your, only your light shine through. Let every word that I speak be from you. Let everyone know that you are alive, and that you flow through this form, and that these are your words. In Jesus' mighty name I pray, amen. Oh, hallelujah.
Romans chapter 1, verse 18, God's wrath against sinful humanity. The wrath of God is being revealed from heaven against all the godlessness and wickedness of people who suppress the truth by their wickedness. Since what may be known about God is plain to them, because God has made it plain to them. For since the creation of the world, God's invisible qualities, his eternal power and divine nature have been clearly seen, being understood from what has been made, so that people are without excuse. For although they knew God, they neither glorified him as God, nor gave thanks to him. But their thinking became futile, and their foolish hearts were darkened. Although they claimed to be wise, they became fools and exchanged the glory of the immortal God for images made to look like a mortal human being and birds and animals and reptiles. Therefore, God gave them over to the sinful desires of their hearts, to sexual impurity for the degrading of their bodies with one another. They exchanged the truth about God for a lie and worshipped and served created things rather than the creator who is forever praised amen because of this god gave them over to shameful lust even their women exchanged natural sex relate nat natural sexual relations for unnatural ones in the same way the men also abandoned natural relations with women and were inflamed with lust for one another men committed shameful acts with other men and received in themselves the due penalty for their error. Furthermore, just as they did not think it worthwhile to retain the knowledge of God, so God gave them over to the depraved mind, so that they do, do, do what ought not be done. They have become filled with every kind of wickedness, evil, greed, depravity. They are full of envy, murder, strife, deceit, and malice. They are gossips slanderers, God-haters, insolent, arrogant, and boastful. They invent ways of doing evil. They disobey their parents. They have no understanding, no fidelity, no love, no mercy. Although they know God's righteous decree that those who do such things deserve death, they not only continue to do these very things, but also approve of those who practice them. This was the message that I was to give to you this morning. And I hope you will sit there and please contemplate strongly on this, very strongly on this. As you will see from these readings, it has described everything that was witnessed on this previous page. And There will be a whole new overhaul, a whole new look to this page, and um, this page is only here to glorify the source, and that's it. There are no gurus. There are only teachers here to provide you with the word of the source to guide you to the light. That's it. That's it. I will also be sharing further teachings on the spirit world with you. The entities and beings that inhabit our forms, um, what, what these beings are, and these are the beings that cause all of the things that were just read about in these verses here, that cause homosexuality, that cause sexual impurity, See, I never understood this before because I also was asleep when I used to hear these verses. And my biggest saying that I used to say was, well, God, if God made the homosexual, then God knew what the homosexual was going to do. And that is not true. Because we are not these forms. We are pure consciousness and prana, and that's it. It is the entities and beings that inhabit these forms that cause, cause the beings on this planet to do evil and to sin against God. And this is what this page will be about, nothing else.
on that note, I bless you all, and I hope that you have a blessed and beautiful day. All.